the excitement among General Hospital fans reaches a fever pitch. As Lucas makes his highly anticipated return to Port Charles after an extended absence that has not only transformed him, but also left an indelible mark on the community he once called home. Lucas's previous visit to the town occurred earlier this year, albeit briefly, when he returned to honor the memory of his beloved mother, Bobby, following her passing, and now he's back not only getting on with his life, but also doing the work he loves. His identity has always been intertwined with the legacy of his father, Julian Jerome, a character known for his complex relationship with the underworld of organized crime. Julian was ensnared in a perilous web of obligations to a man named Cyrus, a situation that spiraled out of control and ultimately led him to make a catastrophic decision. He was compelled to personally deliver a devastating bomb that would obliterate the floating rib, a popular local establishment. Um, the ensuing explosion did not just wreak havoc on the structure. It resulted in tragic fatalities. Among the casualties was Lulu, the mayor's daughter, whose life would irrevocably change as she slipped into a coma. Once Sonny and Jason learn that Julian is the one who planted the bomb, they hunt him down in hopes of making him pay for his wrongdoing. In a climactic confrontation that echoed with tension, Sonny made the split-second decision to pull the trigger. The gunshot rang out, and Julian's fate seemed sealed as he fell. You know, his bond with Lucas had always been characterized by contention. Yet beneath the layers of discord lay a deep well of care and love. So Lucas's return could be the start of him getting revenge on Sonny for taking his father's life. And because he suspects Sonny is involved in John Kate's death, Lucas may go this route to expose the boss's crimes. Furthermore, the mysterious gun sent to the PCPD could be from Julian. It is likely that he is not dead yet and he and Lucas are getting ready for a confrontation with Sonny. 